My dear people of God, God is good. And all the time, I welcome you to our celebration of the day once again, and more so to reflect on the scriptures of the day, which is emphasizing on the call to love. And this is one of the reasons as to why we were created as from simple catechism, we were created to know God, to love him, and to serve him. Two things are involved when we are exercising our duty of loving. The first one is you will get people who will appreciate you when you reach out to those who are truly in need, as we are called in the first reading, that you who have something demonstrate your love by sharing that to others. When you have something like food or clothing or a shelter or just a little gesture of companionship for those who are lonely and abandoned, when you reach out to these people, they will appreciate you. God is good. And they will say, thank you for giving me this. Thank you for reaching out to me. Thank you for accompanying me. That is one positive element. The other one which is a little challenging that when you are carrying out this ministry of loving your neighbor, those who are not champions of loving by demonstration will hate you, will abandon you, will call you names, will taint your names, will persecute you. Because what you are doing is challenging their lifestyle you are excelling and yet they are not excelling. And that's why you are told today that when such things happen to you, please do not be afraid. Continue, have courage, continue that mission of loving your neighbor. And when these things happen, please remember who was like you who carried out this mission, that is Jesus Christ. For truly indeed, he did so much. But what happened to him? He was betrayed. He was abandoned, he was crucified, he was persecuted. And that's why today we are called upon, when you're on the mission of loving one another, please remember you are called upon to carry the cross every day and follow Jesus, be ready to suffer the consequences of that good gesture that you are giving to people and never give up. Jesus never gave up on that mission. He carried it out to the end, and for sure that's why we are still celebrating his life up to now. When you carry on that mission of loving one another, up to the end, your name will be erased in the, people, in the hearts of those who, whom you touch their lives. Those who reach out to them, you'll be alive even though you've already le le left this world to heaven. And so you call today, my dear people, reach out to people and show them the best love in your lives, wherever you are. In the name of the Lord, we praise forever and ever. Amen.